If you can hold the screwdriver, you can help me. That was actually something out of a horror movie. I'm the most afraid of the people under the stairs. So you got emotion sickness? <laughs> I basically was given the job on the spot, and I start this week. So out! Good morning, it's Wednesday, and I just have to give a couple of shout outs here very quickly. Firstly, big huge shout out to Matt or Mr. Bilbo33 on YouTube, as his note said. <laughs> um, he was kind enough to actually send this over off of my wish list. This is a new microphone. I have huge aspirations for my channel, and this is helping me out so much. You Recording with microphone! Oh, hell yeah! Oh, f You have no idea how excited I am about this. Also, this did not come with a note, but whoever sent this, please let me know because thank you so much. This is actually a new battery for my phone. Oh my goodness, my phone battery is... Barely holds a charge sometimes, and it just, my phone shuts off at halfway. I film everything on my phone and I use this for everything so this is a huge help. I, I cannot express to you both enough whoever sent this the second one. <laughs> I'm just not completely sure so I don't want to thank the wrong person but thank you guys so much for sending these over because you Ginger is just as excited as I am apparently. It's just I don't have um, much equipment here and all I've ever done was film on my phone so you guys are really helping me Ginger, you guys are really helping me be able to film the content that I want to film with what I have here. I am so grateful. I am so thankful. Thank you so much. Anyways, today, like I said, it's Wednesday, and I am just getting ready to go out with Josie. We are going to go to Giant Tiger. I haven't been there in a while, but... As you can see, I'm running out of space for my DVDs, and I have already have more for a collection, so I'm going to go buy another one of these shelves. This is on sale at Giant Tiger right now for $15, so that's where I'm going to head with Josie. Then I have a whole day of editing and filming to do because I'm really trying to get caught up on everything. So, that's what I'm doing, and that's where I'll be. You know, Bean, I, I didn't ask for help, but... If you can hold the screwdriver, you can help me. Hey, I'm talking to you. We went to multiple stores today, and I could not find this black one, but I found this white one with no backings and no bottom. So we're just going to work with what we have. I have to... My little area is coming along so well. Things are a little crooked, but we got to, I think, move this so that we can put this up there and kind of reorganize what's going on. So, I'm actually going to head to Goodwill because I am going to be sending out my welcome packages. So I'm going to go to Goodwill and the dollar store to get some last like finishing touches on what I want to send out. And I'm going to go see if I can find some more trinkets for my little shelf here. So, that's where I am going now. Uh, what do you think about this holographic pleather skirt? <laughs> Later that same evening. The most terrifying thing just happened. I was sitting in the window. I was doing some arts and crafts. And, uh, like, my apartment went black. And then... I look out the window and the entire city is black. Like parts of the city still don't even have power. I'm pretty sure that our generator kicked on. I don't know what happened. A bunch of cars were stopped in the parking lot. Like everything just stopped for a good five minutes. I have like flashlights. I had a lighter in my hand, the phone for a flashlight. Like I was, the cats were tripping. I was tripping, the air went off. Terrifying! That was actually something out of a horror movie. I had to fight the urge to yell for my mom. Hello! It is... Thursday? <laughs> I am so much to do. I'm so overwhelmed. And what I do when I'm overwhelmed is clean because it distracts me and I don't have to think about the nine million things I have to do which you can see behind me. Um, so, one of the things that I have done today is I'm cleaning my room, or our room, so I swapped. We have a brand new TV from my uncle who passed away. Uh, he left 
a TV for whoever took it and we took it. Uh, so this TV is actually my first smart TV and I'm very thankful, but that's very dark. Anyways, this is our new TV. This was our old TV. I am just trying to clean up everything. Laundry, my spooky corner, everything. Just everything is trashed right now and I just need to clean, so. Currently waiting on a package from Amazon. I ordered a phone case so that I don't break my phone. And then I have to go pick up some groceries because there is no groceries in this house and I cannot keep ordering pizza every day. Even though I like to. I would really like to. Uh, so. So the Amazon guy just came to drop off my- Oh my god, Ginger! I'm talking! <sighs> the Amazon guy just came to drop off my phone case, and he was like, Do you mind taking this package to 206? That's- He was such a nice little man. He probably just wanted to go home, like, Of course I'll take your package to 206. Like, how nice! But if, if you can see this, th well, obviously you can see this. Who the what the fuck am I talking about? This is my new phone case. Do you like it? It is rose gold and shock absorbent. So when I drop it, I won't break my phone. Okay, huge shout out to Ryan, Ryan Moody, because not only is he like a huge supporter of my channel, but he sent over. I'm 99% sure that this is my backdrop stand. Which means we can start doing themed videos, guys. Okay, hear me out. One second. Ken. Um, I, I love holidays. I love doing themed things. And the reason why I put this backdrop on my wish list was so that we could start doing like spooky Halloween videos, Christmas themed videos, like Easter, like any, you know, holiday, birthday, like anything to celebrate. I just love to celebrate and I think it would be fun if we actually themed the videos. Let me know what you guys think. Thank you, once again, Ryan. Holy crap. Came out this way to see the rainbow wall and take some photos, but it's all blocked off for construction. <laughs> So now we're on our way to go and find DVDs. I'm on the hunt for Saw 1 and for um, Freddy vs. Jason. So we're gonna go there and then we are off to the comic book store once again because we found out how cheap comics were. <laughs> so now we're going to go stock up from ourselves. Okay, didn't find what I was looking for, but I did find this really cool Texas chainsaw with a lot of like extras inside of it, so we'll unbox it on my second channel. But you guys know I am the most afraid of the people under the stairs, so I'm buying it to face my fear. Look at this clockwork orange poster. I've never noticed this here before. That's so Queen's Reich. Wow. So last week when I was here there was a Texas Chainsaw Massacre doll, if you guys remember me showing that. So let's try and find it. also get this. This is the Nightmare Before Christmas. This guy right here always reminded me of Dr. Satan from House of a Thousand Corpses for some reason. I think if I were to get anything Nightmare Before Christmas related it would have to be this. This is so cute. I love Sally. Uh, you probably can't see. Fun fact for you, Vice Admiral Haldo was actually played by Laura Dern in the new Star Wars. Ah, I happened to turn around and I found it. <laughs> He's so cool. I uh, 
I saw this last week with all the murder weapons and like interchangeable hand pieces. I thought it was the coolest thing. So instead of Texas Chainsaw, I'm going to get this. I think she would look so much cooler in my section. Oh, hang, hang on, just show him how many you got. <laughs> all of these are Green Lantern comics, so he's very excited about that. Awkward. Oh, I'm so backlit. Anyways, it is Sun Saturday. We are on our way to a mini comic book convention. We're stopped at the park right now, having a quick lunch from 7-Eleven because they now sell vitamin water out of their big old machines. So we are here enjoying a lunch. Can't see much out of my angle because my I'm so backlit, but we're here. <laughs> Miranda sings. So this is where we just went. It was a lot smaller than we thought it was going to be, but he just got 10 Flash comics for $10. So that was awesome. You're getting motion sickness? <laughs> My ankles are. I have holes. <laughs> God, that's the face of a distressed person. Because I'm wearing pleather and it's all stuck to me. Off. Off. Huh. Yas. Oh. Now you're just a robot. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> I drank too many big cups and now I have to pee. Oh. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. Where are we? <laughs> How do you not know where we are yet? Because I never come this way. It's rather difficult walking around in these comic books, sliding all over the place. And then she's like, "Can you just take a photo of me?" <laughs> oh sure. With what? My fourth arm? <laughs> where are we going to eat now? Where are we going to eat now? Yeah. Well, we're going to go to the dollar store to get a couple of things for my patrons because I'm doing some special custom artwork and then I guess we'll go to Taco Bell Taco Bell so I made a quick stop at Goodwill and you guys know that I have my DVD collection so I found these which are DVD holders somehow there are 16 of them but I'm only gonna take six this should be enough for what I have at home right now plus found the complete first season of the X-Files so good day one of my biggest fears is peeing or using public bathrooms and I'm in Taco Bell right now and one of the toilets has diarrhea all over the, the, the seat and one of the, the toilets has wet toilet paper all over the seat and I just gotta pee so bad. Hey y'all. I just really wanted to quickly come on here and give you guys a little bit of an update. If you guys watched my vlog last week, you would have seen that I... Oh! Hey! Hey! Okay, my mom came over anyways. If you would have seen my last vlog, you would have seen that I was offered a job as a cosmetologist. And today, I went to go bring my resume in and I basically was given the job on the spot and I start this week. So thank you anyone, everyone who sent over well wishes last week because you know what? Keeping me in your thoughts really helped because I got the job and I feel like this is really going to put the foot in the door where I need it to be and I'm, I'm just very excited. So this is where I'm going to end the vlog. I knowing that I have to start working this week like I'm getting hives because I'm like anxious but I have to like clean my entire house I have to pre-film a bunch of videos I just have to you know finish all of my work for patreon I gotta get everything all to you know set up and together so that when I do start work I don't lose my mind entirely so I have like three days of prep time also I gotta go buy some pants because all of my black pants that I own have rips in the knees <laughs> so uh, 
it's just a couple of days of crunch time, but I'm just very thankful and I'm very happy. It has been three years since I had a job. I had to quit my job in 2016 when I found that I had cancer and I wouldn't be able to work anymore. And it, just three years of medical problems. And finally we have my gallbladder under control, have the liver under control, have everything under control and I can finally get back to work. And so I just feel so thankful. So thank you for watching this week and I will see you in my next vlog. Nope. I will see you in my next video. Can't really guarantee what it's going to be, but it's going to be something trying to please everyone here. So thank you for watching and I will see you next, next time. Sayonara suckers.